What is going on YouTube? I'm Valentino with Next Gen Speed coming at you with another video today about the all new 2020 GT500. And before I dive into this video, I just wanna let you know I got some merch available now, which are these shirts, look just like this. Got some other ones right here. It's pretty much a Next Gen Speed style t-shirt. I even got some other ones, including like some Camaro t-shirts, some Mustang ones, and some more to come. So if you wanna get one, check out the website or link below and just pick one up if you like. All right, guys, so this picture of this GT500 was released today by Kyle Yaldo, which is Sinister Life, if you guys know him from Instagram or YouTube. He's a pretty well-known guy around the Michigan and car community. So we said how Ford had a little special event for dealers to see the new models that are coming out, including the 2020 GT500. He posted a couple of pictures, which are pretty much showing only like the right front corner of the car. But he's pretty much the only person who have seen the GT500 so far, the only pictures that we've actually seen of the car itself. And it honestly looks amazing. It looks fucking clean. It looks fucking nice. It definitely looks mean. And obviously with the GT500, it obviously looks like a beefed up GT350 that looks like it just got a, like a bunch of steroids and just got hooked up. So you can tell on the front and rear fenders, they look significantly wider. The whole front has been opened up to improve airflow, to allow more air to come, which improves more power. If you take a look at the rear at the tires, you can expect some big meaty tires on this car. They look around like 305 to 315s, but we'll probably have 305s to compare it to Z01 and 1LE. So expect some big meat back there. And some people are saying this is a Photoshop picture, but honestly isn't. You can tell right away that it's a legit picture, not photo edited at all. And it was actually geotagged by the location at Ford Motor Company in Dearborn, Michigan, which is right down the street from me. So it seems legit. It seems like it's all really how it's about to look. And since Ford has been teasing us for months, this looks like the real deal. So as everything has been speculation so far, we don't have exact specs on this car, but we can expect it to have a V8 pushing around 700 or plus horsepower to compete with the Camaro and the Hellcats and the cars like that. So with the GT350, it was nice, it packed a punch, but with 526 horsepower and a naturally aspirated V8, it honestly was not enough at all to mess with the Hellcats or anything with like, or anything in that line. So with this new model, we expect around 700 plus horsepower, and we're not sure exactly what the specs are gonna be. But we can obviously expect it to be a 5.2 V8. We can expect it to have a dual clutch transmission from the Ford GT supercar. But as it's not 100% confirmed, it could be a 10 speed from the other cars too, but we're just not sure if there'll be a three pedal setup for this car that can handle as much power as it can put out. <laughs> so we're not sure if it has a manual yet, but we'll keep you posted. And if this does have an automatic transmission, this will be the first automatic transmission offered for the GT500. And pretty much all the other details are left out because you can't really see the car too much. There's only like one corner of the car you can see and you can't see under the interior or under the hood at all. So we're still staying tuned on that. So we'll let you know on that out. So I'll be still waiting here until the auto show in Detroit, which is coming up in January. And I will be there myself, letting you guys know all about it with all that. So if you guys want to stay tuned and get some more GT500 news, please hit the subscribe button below. If you like this video, please click this like button. And just know we have a lot more information coming, a lot more content, so stay tuned, guys, all right? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys next time.